When I committed to South Carolina, uh, you know, it was actually the day before signing day, and uh, Coach Beamer called, you know, and uh, said that he had a scholarship, you know, to the University of South Carolina, and you know, I was, I was, it was a blessing, and that's something that that was always my dream to come here. So I didn't have an official signing day because I enrolled early. We didn't have an early signing period back in 2009, 2010. But I absolutely remember how excited I was when I committed. It was at the spring game going into uh, the 2009 football season for the Gamecocks. And I was at a spring game, met with the coaching staff before the spring game and committed uh, with my family. And it was, uh, it was pretty simple to me, man. I, I knew I wanted to play in the SEC. Uh, I saw how passionate the fan base was here. I saw how committed the state uh, is to Gamecock football. And I, along with many other people, wanted to come to South Carolina to do things for the very first time. And um, I committed to South Carolina. I took only one other visit, and that was uh, to Tennessee. That was number two on my uh, list. And had other schools offer me, but you know, I come from a little small country town, and we're talking once you commit to something, you're committed to it. And I never wavered. So. The day I uh, signed my national letter of 10th day was, um, we was in the gymnasium at the West Side High School and my family came, um, people was all in there and had the, the scoreboard where I stood in the middle of it and I had my hat on, um, I had a t-shirt over my, uh, my tie and my button up um, and it was a Gamecock, big Gamecock t-shirt and I wanted everybody to know where I was going. Uh, I wasn't shy away from where I was going to do. My signing day was pretty epic. I had one hat lined up and it was the only hat and it was the University of South Carolina. That was it. You know, it came down to, you know, here in Florida, obviously me being a Florida guy. And um, the thing that stuck out to me most was, was this loyalty you know, and consistency. You know, when I came here, as opposed to going to there, everybody knew my name, everybody spoke to me. The decision to come here um, was pretty much based off the family atmosphere. Um, you know, and so that was big for me. You know, just, just coming to a place like Carolina, that you know it's a family atmosphere, everybody cares about who you are as a person. Make the reverse, pressure is on, got to make the rest yeah, my signing day was uh, back in 1998. It wasn't as big as it is now. We were in, the, I think, the library. It was such a long time ago, I can't remember. But I committed uh, early. You know, Skip Holtz came up, came to the house, and I was I was ready to be a Gamecock. Just you, you feel it. You feel the energy. You feel the love, and you feel how things are starting to build uh, here. And just being a part of something special. You're going to be a something. You can be a leader. You can be a, you can be someone that changes the whole culture here. You can be a guy that's known forever. For you know, for doing one play, for doing one thing right, or for just or being a superstar, whatever, you can be known here forever because that's how the Gamecock way. You no, know, it's it's the way we. They know you. They will always know you, and they will always love you here at South Carolina. Just in there, a lot of people. Don't, I was like one of the first people like to come in early. My signing day experience was actually my mom doing my signing day at my high school for me, but I was already here in school, already being developed. Signing day, man, is gonna be one of the best days of your life, man. You are gonna make a decision. I know you probably heard this. It's not gonna last three to five years. It's gonna last 40 years. And very similar to back in 2009, where we could see the direction and growth of the program. That's the sort of vibe that I get now, and see how hungry our players are, and uh, you know where uh, the potential for for the near future for South Carolina.